Deep in the Sierra Nevada mountains is a magical place. Great things are happening in the great outdoors at Camp Womp. We are Steve and Elizabeth Wampler and we're the founders of Camp Womp. Steve Wampler was born with cerebral palsy, a condition he's never fought sitting down. Nine years ago, Steve wanted to do something spectacular to put the Wampler Foundation on the map. So he became the first person with CP to climb the Yosemite's El Cap. It is the biggest rock face in the world. Steve's wife, so Elizabeth, says that's her husband climbing twice the height of the Empire State Building, two inches at a time. Life is at your fingertips. Camp Womp makes memories for children bigger than the trees that surround them. Earlier this year, we met a boy in the Zevele Zone by the name of Laird Murphy, who stole the hearts of our viewers. I'm sure you remember his song. Laird attended Camp Womp this summer, and it turns out he's a spitting image of Steve when he was a boy. Laird had never been to our camp before. He's 11 years old now, and he was a champion. At Camp Womp, kids are encouraged to take the road less traveled, then sleep under the stars and make a wish. It's still about what you can do. Steve graduated from college, fell in love with Elizabeth, and raised a family together. Just thinking about it makes them laugh because the first time they met, Elizabeth didn't know what to say. How are you today? Like, you know, like, oh and my I God, didn't. This lady crazy. What's wrong with her? <laughs> my dream is to inspire. A movie about Steve's life called Wampler's Ascent could soon be shown on Netflix. Did it put you on the map? Oh, oh yeah. Yes, wow. it did. <laughs> All Steve ever wanted was to scream this message from a mountaintop. You can do whatever you put your mind to. In the Zevely Zone, Jeff Zevely, News 8.